Hey, what's up everyone, Ultimate Atomic HD here, and today I'm continuing my let's play on SmackDown vs. Raw 2011. And today we'll be starting a new story. And his name is John Cena! <laughs> Alright, you know, you knew all this, all you knew this was one, this one was coming. Man, I forget to speak every day. So as you heard, we're doing John Cena next. Because I didn't get any requests for other stories. Yeah, this story is fun. And you know what, since this, since I'm on my return for holidays, and it's Christmas Eve, by the way, and... Why don't I make it a special of 40 minutes? It's gonna be awesome. Alright. I can go directly to a match. From Montreal, Quebec, Canada. Welcome. Yeah, we know. Welcome to Monday Night Raw. There's MVP, our next opponent. In the road to WrestleMania. You can't see me. Yeah, MVP versus Cena. Alright, a singles match. Yeah, John Cena is also chasing WWE Championship here. And he's not going to steal it or anything like Jericho. His personality is more to tolerable. I like it much, much more than... Uh, uh, yeah, Chris Jericho's story. He's not going to do any anything rude or impolite or arrogant like Jericho. He's a fair man. As he says himself. Alright. On. Look at Cena go. Cena with momentum early on. Can't see me, bam. He's looking to fly. Come on. Let's take flight. Bam. Oops. Didn't see that coming. Okay, new plan. You can't see me, boom. Alright, five knuckle shuffle. Oh, it has to be at, in the middle of the ring in order for me to go forward. There we go. I didn't want to do that, but okay. Five knuckle shuffle. Yeah, whatever. Uh, Alright, I'll wait for attitude adjustment then. Well, he, he's just standing there waiting to receive my punch, wow. <laughs> well, nothing. You should just sit back and enjoy. Alright, come on, get up. Want to do your... Oh, STF! Let's do the STF instead. Powerbomb? That's an STF, are you blind? Come on, tap out. That arm sustained so much punishment, it's going to be very difficult to hit any of those big moves with it. There we go. First match of mission as well. Just as like in the previous story. Yeah, there you go. Randy Orton is the WWE Champion this time. This time Orton is a bit arrogant and uh, yeah, my phone is ringing. Mr. John C. That was some war we had last week. Now I ain't mad that you won. Because MVP looks good even when you lose. I'm sure he does. One hell of a match, MVP. Now that you're the number one contender, you can bet Orton has some things up your sleeve. Would mind helping you against him and his cronies? Come track me down. I have a plan to initiate a kind of preemptive strike. Sounds good. I'll swing by in a bit. Alright. Yeah, I won't be doing that.
Raw's live from Boston. Yeah, and I have I have like two markers where I need to go, but uh, you can only choose one. And I'm gonna go to the bottom locker room. All right. Oh, well, look hey who guys. finally showed up, Ted. John, number one contender, Cena. The way I look at it, Cena, beating a chump like MVP doesn't give you the right to take on an icon like Randy Orton. The way I look at it, your time is through. Or at least it will be when we're done with you. Your time is through. Cody Rhodes and Ted DiBiase are so lame, easy opponents here. It's so... It's, yeah. The only thing you're gonna be number one. There we go. Is that, this is how lame they are. They are. They're supposed to be working together, but they do this. Nope. Ah. MVP is gonna show up soon to help us, so not worrying. Shoulder block. Into the TV you go. I guess my e-bike to this party ended up in my junk folder. Think I'll yeah. join anyway. <laughs> His jokes are hilarious. Come on. Yeah, there we go. MVP is taking care of that one while I submit Ted DiBiase. Nice, Nani Burster. Ah! He busted out. Ah! Ah, there we go. Flame strategy again. Wow. There we go. He's down. Eat my knees. Bam. And now I need to do a little adjustment to your attitude. Also known as attitude adjustment. Ah, that, this should knock him out. One dead, there we one go. Down, one more to go. Alright, you... Bam. Just do this continuously. Okay. No, no! MVP, why did you do that? Ouch. Come on. I need to do a little attitude. A little adjustment to his attitude, sorry. And this should knock him out, I think. There we go. By way of KO. Now we have ourselves a little cutscene. There we go. Go run home crying to your first generation superstar daddies. This isn't over, Cena. You're never going to make it to the Royal Rumble. Well, you better come with more than that next time, pal. <laughs> Randy didn't wait long before he started lobbing grenades, did he? And like usual, his plan didn't work out as he hoped. He'll try again. And we'll beat him back again. Because you're going to stop Orton at the Royal Rumble. That means I gotta be your guardian angel until the Rumble. Well, I can handle that. Yeah. We're buddies. MVP and I are buddies. Yeah. Alright. Next week. Message. Yeah, there we go. Only one Boy, place live to go. The Big Apple. The King of oh, New York. Nice. Crazy Cena? I'm not. I've in my office telling me that you and MVP beat him up last week. No. What are you going to do? Ground me? Since you and MVP enjoy ganging up on people so much, Tonight you're getting a taste of your own medicine. The two of you are facing Legacy in a two-on-three handicap match. Wow. Look, Stephanie, you put whoever you want in there with Orton. I got something for him. Here's what I got for you. <laughs> wow. 
schooled. I tell ya. Ooh, Batista. Could use your help in the handicap match. Need a third man. Oh yeah. Here comes fun. You ready for a little payback? After you. Bam! There we go. What the hell are you doing in here? Do I detect the hint of fear in your voice, Randy? Not so bad without your boys around, are you? I have no idea what you're talking about. You're gonna send your boys to someone's yeah. locker room to beat someone up. Better make sure they do the job. And if you wanna not get caught, then don't use the same two guys you've been rolling with for years. <laughs> Sounded like a good idea, though. Two guys busting in, beating a lesson into somebody. Mind if I copy you? You can't just barge in here and threaten. A threat is nothing but words. We prefer actions. Yeah. I'll see you later tonight, Randy. Alright, I'll wait for MVP to get out. And I'll follow him. Afterwards. Come on, any time now. Alright. Alright, now I can go straight to the match, but I don't see the indicator for some reason. Message. You got a text message from MVP. I think we got ready in I think we got in Randy's head. Oh yeah, we have to perform both finishers, on oh, both MVPs and both uh, M. John Cena's on Randy Orton before we pin him. Yeah. Well, since this is a handicap match, this is going to be more, much more difficult than a regular tag match. First of all, Randy Orton doesn't start this match off. Ted DiBiase things, uh, I think, starts it off. Alright. Right. The moment I got, get my signature indicator, I'm rushing out of the ring and going after Orton. Yeah, there we go. No, Cody Rhodes is the first boss. Even the popcorn vendor is heading for the hills. He wants no part of this collision. Ah, come on. Stop blocking my attack. Bam. There you go. There you go. Oh, yeah. Randy Orton. Oh, signature. Signature. Come on. Form a signature. Come on. Now. Ah, nice. Oh! That's Randy Orton's famous uh, counter for charge attacks. Uh, there we go. There we go. Randy, come on. No! Oh, this is why I don't like handicap wow. matches. No. Oh. 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 Ted DiBiase now getting served by Cena. That's what you no. gotta say. No. No. Just trying to goad his opponent into making a mistake. Oh, what the hell? Just got a little snozzy there. Come on. There you go. Perform the stupid signature. Why? the ring. Now exit again. No. Well, that was an odd tag. Ah, uh, this is going to take much more than I expected. I wish I wish Cena had a signature while the opponent is fa face up. 
<laughs> on the field. Come on. It's a brawl here. No! Thanks, Orton. Ah, you almost knocked out the referee. And we would have won probably by DQ. No! Why am I pinning him? He's taking a beating. It's a good thing he had two partners to tag out to. Provided he can reach legacy. Ah! You're through! I'm beating the judge. No! Ah! Come on, I need to bust out of here. No! Come on! Slap yeah. to the a chest. There. Uh, nice I'm mad now. I'm really mad now. Oh. John Cena in firm control now. You can't see me. Five knuckle shuffle. Bam! Now, go get, get out, come on. And he's out of the ring again. Now, ah. Looks like he's bringing in his partner. Ah, why am I focused on... on come on, there we go. One finisher down. <laughs> Alright, I'm done with Cena. Now, to tag out with MVP, now his work comes into play. He's a playmaker. Nice. Wrestling hero stone. Come on, get me that finisher. Oh, this is gonna be... Oh, no. Oh, no. No! Oh, I hate this! Bam! No! Please! Ah, that's what you need. There we go. Good thing you get that only once per battle. Bam. Hold on, where's he going? Come on! There we go! All finishers are done! Come on, now it's time to pin him! There we go! One, two, three! Oh, just in the nick of time, Cody Rhodes! Alright! Yeah. Alright. 18 minutes already. I wasted so much time on that match. Oh well. This is a special after all. Stephanie, you need to control those two criminals. Oh Randy, what are you talking about? Cena and MVP. They're running around, threatening me, trying to ambush me. They probably have traps set everywhere. You're a big boy. <laughs> What do you want me to do about it? This is an unsafe work environment. I'm WWE Champion. There are threats against my life. I need round-the-clock security. As a businesswoman, you can't leave your biggest investment unprotected. Can you? I can, and I will. So far, Cena has done nothing to warrant my intervention. And until he does, oh. you're facing him at the Royal Rumble. Now, if that's all... <laughs> you obviously have some bias preventing you from acting sensibly. I'll go above your head on this one if I have to, Stephanie. She doesn't give a damn. Well, alright. I would be ending the video off soon if 
this wasn't a special, so... Two posts again. Uh, okay. Welcome to Monday Night Raw, live from Roanoke. Alright, I'll first go to the locker room. Locker, locker, locker room. Alrighty. Who's here? Orton, of course. You stay back, Cena. Take one more step toward me and I'll have you thrown in jail. So testy. There we go. I've Seems taken like all a these step. schemes are wearing on your nerves, Randy. You want schemes? Ask MVP. That guy will stab you in the back in a heartbeat. Why is he such a friend all of a sudden? MVP doesn't have it in him to do that. Not anymore. Then there's The Miz. I hear he's been looking to jump you. See, what you're doing right now is deflecting. Besides, The Miz? I ain't worried about him. I've beaten him more times than I can count. If you say so, Cena. Alright, that was Cena's biggest mistake going to talk to Orton here, cause you'll see later on what's going to happen. Alright, now to talk to the general manager, Stephanie McMahon. I got this sneaking suspicion. Orton's been around to fill your head with fables and fairy tales. <laughs> you two are making my job a lot more difficult, and I'm getting a little tired of this. And what's your plan to deal with this, might I ask? Business as usual. I have so much... Oh, yeah. Look, I don't have time to talk. Just my phone is ringing. Tonight from the list of superstars without scheduled matches. I'll look at the menu. Sure. Hello? Yes, I understand. Yes. All right. All right, who will you face tonight? Big Show, Dolph Ziggler, or The Miz? All right. Dolph Ziggler, because Big Show is Big Show, obviously, and The Miz is my idol. He has a very awesome song, and his personality is awesome. Heck, his, his song says awesome at the beginning. Right. Alright. Cena versus Ziggler. I believe this is the first time I'm say facing off against Ziggler in, in this let's play. Well he's uh well, he's not that difficult to beat. But you gotta watch for his grip moves that is that are his cue. I am perfection, you're not. Alrighty. So, what are we going to do? John Cena there you go. Dolph Ziggler, the opponent he handpicked tonight. Did he make the right choice, Kit? He may not be seven feet tall, but Ziggler is no pushover. Cena's better bring him. Alright. Ziggler is actually a SmackDown superstar, so what's Cena doing on beating a SmackDown character because he's a Raw superstar? Yeah, grip moves, that's what I tell you, you have to work. watch out against that. He's tired out already. Come on. Pin him. There we go. Road break. What the hell? Signature. Ah. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, boy. Let's go. All the way down. Woo. There you go. Ah! Oh, can't you just stay? Oh. Ziggler a bit quicker on that exchange. Yeah. Those are Ziggler's big moves that you have to watch out about when you're facing him. I'm on pin him. And a rope break. Stupid rope break. 
Watch it! That was like a freight train! What? There's the pin! Can his opponent kick out? Three! There we go. Cena wins! Cena wins! And Ziegler loses. Wait, that's wrong. And his name is John Cena! Your time is up, my time is now. now. You can't. Alright, now let's continue. Ted and Cody. Oh. Why am I not surprised to see you here? Whoa. Put the safety on, Loose Cannon. We're not here to fight. <laughs> yeah. Th there's no need to get violent. We're just here to let you know that there's been a change of plans. Not as far as I know. <laughs> the plan is, was, and, and will, will be this. I plan on dumping Orton on his head and walking out the WWE champion. Well, that's going to be pretty hard when you hear the news, lunatic. Maybe you better go speak to Stephanie. After you calm down, madman. The news. What are the news? Time to see for ourselves. The Royal Rumble has finally arrived here in our nation's capital. I need to go to Orton's locker room again. Why don't we do it then? Oh, these two. Keep busy walking. John Cena, Vladimir Kozlov, and Ezekiel What's Jackson. We got orders not to let you anywhere near the WWE Champion. Well, you're going to have trouble following these orders when I'm pinning him in that ring tonight. You have a problem? Talk to GM. Don't talk to us anymore. Okay. Let's do it then. Yeah, you can't see me. Actually, since I've got time, I'll upgrade my stats at the training room. I have a lot of people. And the damage resistance level. Alrighty. You have some explaining to do, Stephanie. Yeah. Calm down, Cena. Look, Orton went over my head. After that alleged assault, Randy got a restraining order against you and MVP. There's nothing I can do. A restraining order? Now, how is that going to work? Check your calendar. My foot has an appointment with his cranium tonight. <laughs> or it doesn't. Your title shot is off. It's out of my hands. These two are here to make sure you don't try anything as you exit the arena. Please vacate the arena calmly, okay? Alright, how do you answer Steph? This does not change the flow of the story, but I'm gonna agree with her. Are you starting to believe Orton's lies? You think I'm some kind of maniac? Well, I'm not. I'll leave quietly. But this ain't over. Right, these two are here now. Alright, now you wanna run. Trust me, you want to run here. You don't want to be slow, folks. Yeah, hear those extra footsteps? They're after us. Come on. There we go. Look, Cena, you can't beat Randy. He's just too smart. And he asked us to leave you this reminder. Ouch. Alright, now it's a handicap match again, but this time against Ezekiel and Kozlov. Hey, you don't have to win this, but hey ho, you can, so why not? You didn't want to live without competition, yes? Alright, dumb move again. As you can see, they're dumb as Cody and uh, what's the other name? Ted DiBiase. Come on, there we go. Oh yeah, right into that glass. 
Windshield, I mean. Come on. Time to extinguish the fire that lives within you. Yeah. Time to extinguish the fire that lives within you. Yes. Ouch. <laughs> there we go. I like I like the little clever moves that knock big guys like him down. Ah. You're... Jesus Christ! I forgot you can do that. You want to extinguish my fire? My soul is on fire! And it can't be extinguished. Unlike... Yours! Damn it. I did that wrong. It's time to do it again. Ah, I think he's knocked out, Ezekiel. Time to extinguish the fire that lives with... Ouch! Keep... You interrupt me! Alright, I had enough. Time... To duel! Alright, the fire extinguisher is out of use. Audition the ground, Sina! Alright, Ezekiel is done. Now for the Russian, Vladimir Kozlov. Alright. One more time. One more time. Bam! <laughs> One more time. Bam. Oh yeah. And I'm done. Yeah, I'll have a time limit as well. I didn't know that. Alright, I can only record for eight more minutes. What can I do for eight minutes? Yeah, I got some SP. Alright, I need to vacate the arena after beating those two. Oh yeah, nice! Kofi's paying me back. Kofi Kingston has the champion hurt. They have come out as a last minute replacement, but he can leave a champion. Oh, that's just cruel. To the arena floor. It's a dirty tactic, but this is a no disqualification. Oh, no. That's just uncalled for. How can Kofi survive against this onslaught? That fight for Randy Orton has all the angles covered. Well, you just saw that Randy Orton is a champion that relies on help for some others to keep Here's his title. Going. And still, WWE champion. This is a disgrace. Kofi and Orton really the best. Again, I'm not advocating his actions, but you have to expect those kind of things when you face Randy Orton. But how long will he have to endure this tyrannical reign as WWE Champion King? Until I dethrone him. Yeah. Forward to the Royal Rumble match is next. Alright, as you can see, Cena has a... Yeah, there we go. He's going to WrestleMania to take on the champion of his choosing. What a catch to a wild night, Michael. This is the craziest Royal Rumble I can think of. Alright, MVP won the Royal Rumble and I need to dethrone... Yeah, I need to dethrone Randy Orton. I have time for one more match, I believe. Ladies and gentlemen, Raw has returned to Memphis. All right. Oh, I know what's next. It's a mixed tag match. Uh, me and Mickey James against Ziggler and uh, Maurice. Maurice, yeah. Okay. Explaining to do again. Stephanie McMahon, just the general manager I'm looking for. You get my title shot worked out yet? Cena, 
You have no idea what it's like to do my job. And your antics don't make it any easier for me. You know I earned that title shot. You're like yeah. Randy Orton push you around. Yeah, I know you earned that title shot. Yeah. I can give you a reminder that I'm a McMahon Cena. Look, tonight there's a mixed tag match that needs a spot filled. I'm putting you in it. You've got your match, now just go compete. You seem pretty stressed, Steph. You need a hug or a can of soup or something? <laughs> just leave, Cena. Just leave. All right. Now I get. Now I have to speak. Dad, she's my opponent tonight. Yeah, let's talk to her. Uh, just go away. If you say so, but you'll be regretting you those words. Now to speak to my beautiful partner here. Hey, Cena. I hear you're my tag partner tonight. Yeah, Mickey. That's what they tell me. Anything I need to know? Only that we're going up against the blondest, most conceited pair in WWE history. But with you on my side, I feel a whole lot better. Ooh, yeah. I feel a lot better, too. Alright. Let's see if we can pull this off under four minutes. Ah, there we go. I'm getting really close to Elimination Chamber, which is kind of cool. Yeah, since the Royal Rumble was last time, I think this is week 5. Wow. Two specials and I'm only at week 5? Well, that just... Yeah, I lost a lot of time on that uh, tag match. Handicap match. Yeah, Maurice. Now, Ziggler Man. And Mickey James. Yeah. All right, now for the John Cena, the future WWE champion. Alright! Alright, there we go. Exactly where we we'd end up tonight, Watch it. Oops. Uh, one head warning when you're in a double, I mean a mixed tag match. Don't punch the, the... If you're playing as a male superstar, don't punch the WWE Diva because you're gonna get disqualified. Alright, here's what I like to do in these matches. Tag out, and then beat the shit out of him. Damn! I like her combos. Come on. No! No! Ah! Come on. Ah! Oh! Look at the athleticism on display there. She tosses her opponent over the top rope. Mickey. There you go. <laughs> oh yeah, there we go. Two. Time for her finisher. Three. There we go. Oh, ho, ho. he came flying off there. Come on, I'm gonna win by a count out. Seven, oh. She's in bad shape here. She's gotta make the tag. Alright, come on. There you go. Oh, no! Ah. Two minutes I have remaining until 14 minutes of recording. Oh, oh, oh. Come on. And now he's back out on the apron. Oh man. Hurting the wrist of the lower back. That just takes all of the power out of him. And he finally gets out of the Come on, stupid. I don't want to do that. He... Oh, no. See what's the problem here? Uh, oh, she's focused on the on Maurice and the lock and the focus counter doesn't move to Ziggler when I walk towards him. 
And that's my biggest problem with uh, the multi-opponent matches. There we go, that's what I wanted to do in a while. Would you stop complaining about the stupid road breaks? Alright, now, to get... Uh, let me get rid of you. Again, really. To get rid of you. Come on, Cena, go clear that up for me. There we go. We're working as it. Thank you, Cena, for not clearing up my other opponent. I am very grateful. One, two. No! His, his hand hit the ground right when he was about to say three and just. This douchebag came along and pulls me up. Oh, no! Uh, no! Ah, uh, uh, over again. 40 minutes of recording already. I'm 37 seconds behind. Alright, I need to end this now! I need to end this! Come on! Do it! Just do it! Hallelujah. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna s let you see all this because. Yeah, it's the end of the video now, I'm not gonna skip anything. Alright, so that is it for this episode, ladies and gentlemen. It was a great special. Uh, I have a message again. I'm not gonna do that. Um. Actually, I know what the event this is. I'm actually gonna do this and I'm gonna qu call it quits. Mr. Olton. Oh, he's actually going back. Well, well, if it isn't the unchained John Cena, I suppose you're here to get your revenge against me for the Royal Rumble. Yes, of course John, I am. I screwed you. What are you gonna do about it? I'm gonna wait for the right I'm time. I'm gonna wait for the right time. <laughs> and I'm gonna beat you down and take your WWE Championship home at the same time. So what you're saying is you're too much of a coward to do anything to me right now. Oh, I never said I that. I guess it's happened, you know. I've kicked you around for, for so long, you're actually starting to like it. Come on, John. Have... All right. Cena. There we go. <laughs> You'll pay for that, Cena. Only after you do, Randy. Of course. Now time it's time to beat down Orton. Alright. This is going to be really short. You just gotta have to be persistent and then you can end this match really, really fast. Just do as I do here and you should have no problems solving this equation. No! Hey, you stupid little bugger. Let's be persistent. There you go. Alright. So that is actually it for the for the video. Watch this cutscene. Security! Security! John Cena's gone insane! Stay out of this, guys. It's between me and him. Okay. RKO out of Something. nowhere. He attacked me. He's not supposed to be within 20 feet of me. Take him away. Take him to jail. Ooh. John Cena in jail. What will happen next? 
Stay tuned for the next exciting what episode the hell is that? of WWE. John Cena stop. <laughs> Don't forget, that's John uh, that's uh, MVP's too. line. Just go there. back the way you came. This doesn't concern you unless you want to serve more time behind bars. Oh, and you're so arrogant, I'm starting to hate you. <sighs> Alright, John Cena's no longer in jail. I have a message. Alright, so, this is week... No. Load. It's week 7. I'm actually gonna delete this data. This is week 7, so yeah, thank you all so much for watching, stay tuned for more vids, more videos and updates, comment, like and subscribe, and as usual, we'll upload the next part whenever I can, so see you all and have a good day, peace!